Your News Good Day Cafe. Oh, welcome in. We are in for a massive treat here in the Good Day Cafe. It's Mike Newton, Master Chef contestant. Tonight at 8 o'clock, he's going to be on. Now, I can't tell you what's going to happen, but let me tell you something. Uh, I may call Gordon Ramsay and see if we can, you know, put a good plug in for Mike here. Because I'll tell you what, look at those steaks. Are we you kidding me? Two-inch ribeyes we had cut. We're going to do a little simple season. This one just has a salt and pepper mix on it. Uh -huh. But if you want to spice it up, I do a little bit of a pastrami mix, which is basically yeah. coriander, yeah. clove, have a little bit of uh, dry mustard in it. And then, yeah. you know, we'll just season it, these up real easily. Yeah. Be real liberal with it. Just just put, just put season them up. Yeah. We're going to do put you them in this rub hot it skin. in? Do you I do. Rub, Once you rub I get it in, it in right? rub, I just get it nice and thick and just yeah. rub it in, let it sit. It's always good to bring these steaks out about two hours before you're going to eat. Yep. And then what I do is let them come to room temperature. So when you sear them, you're going to get a good char on the outside but they'll cook through if they're cold they're not going to do wow so it's a great way to do the steak so once we get them up hot like this we're just going to bring them on this cast iron skillet it's going to be nice and hot get it up to speed i can feel it we're going to be sizzling in here i'll tell you yeah. by the way i gotta ask you now do you have to wear the hat in order to get the good steak mix going you is, do. Is it the, really is helps. The, is the hat key here? It does. It's, it's right. This is my, this is my little security hat. blanket. Thank I you. really like that hat. So we're just going to lay this in, and we're going to get it going. We Woo! don't touch it. We don't leave it going. It. Leave it alone. Hands off. And we're going to go let it go. How was your experience on Master Chef? Can you tell us that? It was a great experience. You know, here I am from a little bitty town in West Texas, Life yeah. <laughs> You go from the town of Life Ham, maybe population 500, and then you go to L.A. Wow. So you're out there, you're cooking, you're hanging out with all this great talent of mm. kids that are just cooking. I was the oldest guy on the show. Uh, you <laughs> get to cook cool. with Aron Sanchez, uh -huh. as well as Christine Tossi, and of course, Gordon Ramsay. And, you know, and he's an intimidating gentleman. I bet. He is, uh, he, most people don't realize, he's really a pretty good sized guy, too. Uh, oh, really? He is. And, you know, and it was You just, wore the hat on. Uh, I wore the you hat wore, on. You if you're better. looking for me, look for the hat tonight. Look so. at that. I mean, great picture thing. of it searing and, on there. And so we're going to have a little smoke in here, but that's I, okay. That's okay. The fire alarm's fine we're covered up don't worry about it so it's going to be on each side for how long with this thickness we'll do about three minutes on each side of this and then okay. we're going to do the edges you always need to do the yes. edges of your steak mm -hmm. and then what we're going to do is then we're going to take a stick of butter we're going to put a little rosemary a little bit of garlic and then we're going to baste this for about three wow. three to four minutes and we'll finish it off in the oven i like it i like it a lot of course the recipe is on our screen we have uh, already posted it there um any other tricks to it you know, the best thing is just don't mess with your steak. You know, everybody yeah. wants to flip in it. You know, flip it once, flip it twice, leave it alone. Yeah. And, you know, just let it do its magic. You know, let the, let the fire do its job. All right, so I'll have to tell you, it's National Selfie Day. So you know what that means. Well, we have a Master Chef contestant in here with the steam flowing in. You got to take the live selfie. You ready? Bingo. Yeah, there you we go. have it right here. We'll post it for you. Uh, Jason, we'll see. We are back with Master Chef contestant Mike Newton in the Good Day Cafe. This steak smells and looks amazing. We're doing a little bit of the seasoning right now, right. correct? This is called an arrosé. It's a French-style cooking. And it's basically just taking butter. The, cake, the, st the steak has been cooked up to probably a rare to medium rare. So all we're going to do now is just let it ba start basting it. Ooh. We're going to turn it around and just let it go to town. Start basting. You got a little rosemary, a little bit of garlic. And all we're going to do is just start adding the flavor to it. Now, when did you discover your love of cooking? When I was very young, um, I had two older brothers that went off to college, and my mom was down. And so I just started cooking. Um, she didn't have to cook for a big family, so I just started cooking on my own and then had a passion for it. After I left high school, I went and worked on a ranch in Paris, Texas. Had to feed myself, so, you know, <laughs> I just had to, you know, you have to learn to cook. And then I found out, you know, when you, you work on a ranch, and when I was younger, I didn't have any money. You know, you couldn't take a girl on a date. What better way to cook for them? And you, you know, know, rent a movie and We were cook talking for them. about it in the break. They say that a way to a man's heart is through his stomach. The way to a woman's heart is through her stomach with a big old steak, baby. Mm. Then we're really talking. Now, is, is steak one of your favorite things to make? Or you know, what's steak your big is, thing? I don't eat as much steak as I used to, but I think steak and pastas, you know, mm -hmm. putting meals together. Always, My wife always says, you always focus on the main part, but, you know, so I work on the sides and stuff, but I really, you know, how can you not like steak or chicken fried steak? I mean, it's approved by every cardi cardiologist out there. You know? <laughs> I, don't th I think a cardiologist would freak out if you heard about my diet. So we're on the same page. Now, has this one already been flavored a little bit? That is. That so one's ready to go. So I can go, go ahead and dive on in. Knock it out. Oh. Start. Just. This is amazing. Now, 
Talk to us, where are we at in this? Is this a, a medium rare? How are we looking at it? That's going to be a rare to medium rare right okay, there. Okay, perfect. Oh, look at that thing. Because mm -hmm. we always can cook it up a little bit more. You know, always like to let people look at the meat and so. So, Alex, I'll talk to you a little bit about, you know, being on Master Chef. Obviously, you can't give us any secrets. What, what's what been your favorite thing so far, though? You know, meeting all the different people from all over the world you know I mean from all over the country I mean you, know, you met so many different people different personalities and all having really lived together you know for an extended period of time and you know having just and watching how they cook in their region and their style of cooking I mean you know not everybody's a cowboy chef <laughs> not everybody's you know you, you know we had uh, we had a young guy his family's from uh, off the coast of um, Portugal so oh, wow. his style girl from inner honey from uh, inner uh, her name was ebony she's from inner city chicago oh, wow. a different style her, and her husband she's married to a gentleman that's uh, indian and so the, just the dichotomy of cooking that you learn while you're there and plus you get to work with the word ramsey it's pretty, hey, dang, it's pretty dang cool can't beat that at all master chef right here on fox wfxr blast being with you by the way this steak amazing do i have to share it no oh thank it's you. all yours that's a good answer we got another one here for them <laughs> jason